Alright, welcome back to Dark Souls Prepare to Die, part 10. We're at the bottom of Blight Town. We're gonna try and get through this area quickly. Come and get some. Let's see, uh, I don't remember. Yeah, it was the heavy one that one shot them. This one, two shots them. Um, anyway, we're gonna do like a uh, kind of a modified figure eight around here. Um, we're gonna kill most everything. Try not to get poisoned too much, but if we do, it's no big deal. Uh, poison doesn't really do that much damage to you, and you can easily heal through it. Come over here, grab this dude's. Um, there's a slug here. These guys are good to farm. Uh, what is it? Green shards, I think? Yeah, we got poison, but who cares? We can stabify him three times. I guess there's nothing back here. I'm just gonna stand around the poison. Uh, yeah, this is what I'm looking for. Right over here. This is, is this the, uh, Pyromancer starting gear? Poison mist? And, yeah, okay. So there's the poison mist. That's the, uh, spell... Uh, that last person that invaded us was using. Okay, so those guys are not too hard to hit with this sword, as long as they are fairly low to the ground. And I'm just gonna tank the poison damage. I don't really care about it. Uh, that's where we came down over there. So, um, there's two sort of potential ways to go about what to do from here. Um, the... Great Hollow and Ash Lake. Oh, hey oh. Let me back up. These guys actually, um... Oh, okay, that's lovely. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, God. Okay, now I'm actually in danger. Let's get over here. Back up on the land where we can move around a little easier. Healify. Heal us Heal us the fiddle. Fee fo fiddly thumbs. You did? Hey oh, yep. Hey oh. Hey oh. Okay. Um, as I was saying, uh, the Great Hollow is right here. And you can either do it now or save it for later. If you do it now, the best thing to do is probably to only use the bonfire at the top and try to get all the way. Oh man, that's terrible. Can't hit that guy with this sword. Hey, oh! Uh, you can uh, try to only use the bonfire at the top and get all the way through the level and to Ash Lake. Get all the way through Ash Lake and then homeward bone your way out <clears throat> um, so that you don't have to climb all the way up the Great Hollow. That's one way to do it. The other way to do it is to come back here later once you have. Here's another slug. Come back later. You furbity furbity. Scoop scoop scoopity spish bash spoosh. Come back later when you have the uh, the Lord Vessel. And then you can just um, teleport out once you're finished. And that's what I'm going to do. Because that seems like the least hassle. The, un the, uh, the Great Hollow isn't really a difficult area in terms of what you're fighting, but there's so many, like, ledges to fall off, and it's not a linear place, um, at all. <laughs> that I, I may not even record me running around in it. Poison ran off. Good. Uh, but I'm gonna come in here just to get a ring, uh, which I find kind of useful. It's not totally necessary for my build. Oh, something just happened there. We're gonna hit this bonfire up. Do I want to kindle this? Sure, why not? I've been kindling everything. I should be saving my humanity, but I guess I can. I can. Uh, I can farm humanity later. Yeah, I've remained pretty spoiler-free about the expansion stuff, but uh, one of the things I did learn is it's there's an area that's really easy. Oh, I can level up too. There's an area that's really easy to farm humanity. Let's see. Let's get the intelligence to 20. I think we're gonna get access to a new spell at 20. Off the top of my head, I could, could be wrong about that. So anyway, look at this place. This place is a mess. In addition to all the things that you can fall off, all the branches and roots, uh, it's not exactly linear. You have to kind of go up and down different branches to get everything. And there's crystal lizards, aka geckos, all around that will despawn if you don't kill them fast enough. 
And the fastest way to deal with them is to, uh, here we're going to get a ring right here. Fastest way to deal with them is to save out of the game and reload, and they should pop back up. Roll off here. Uh, now we want to get out of here. That's all I wanted is that ring. If I can get up this path without falling off and then turn around, see right over there. Those two things. Those are crystal lizards, aka geckos. Uh, if you, they will disappear, but uh, they will respawn until you kill them. At which point they will not respawn. They drop a lot of good upgrade materials, and uh, if you don't kill them in time, you can reload the game, and they'll come back. See that? Hear that tinkling sound? That's another one. I'm not going to bother this area right now, and I'm probably not going to record it at all because it's so fiddly my health back. Alright, that's all I wanted is that ring. It's uh, We're going to equip it for a while. It boosts stamina recovery. See the up green arrows in the top left corner of the screen. And it's good in an area where I'm going to be burning through my endurance really quickly, uh, running through this poison swamp. And I also find it useful to fight Quilag, the, the chaos witch. Uh, the big spider lady. Um... Because I spend a lot of time running away from her, and at least until I can buy the uh, the Bellowing Dragon Crest ring that buffs my my magic damage, um, I'm gonna wear this ring. I actually need to go back and pick up the Wolf Ring. I forgot to get it when I was in. Let's see what this does. I forgot to get it when I was in. Oh, lovely. Smacks, one shotted. Let's shoot these things before they start moving. You did. You did. You did. You did. You did. No, come back. Uh, or whatever. Okay, so we're uh, we're basically doing kind of like a figure eight around this area. So with this ring, I can I can roll more. My uh, my endurance fills up much faster. We're gonna do like a figure eight. We're gonna grab the stuff here. We're gonna circle back around. Oh, okay. Oh, this is dangerous. Please die. Oh, you didn't die. But you stopped moving. Huh, maybe two-handed isn't the way to go with these guys, because all you have is the stabs. Yeah, I'm definitely ready for a different weapon. I don't know if I'm going to get one anytime soon. <laughs> Particularly for these dudes. Once we get back to the smith, I'll have the opportunity to, to uh, upgrade some different weapons. I may try out something different for a while. Um, we'll see. Let's see. There's a bunch of slugs over here, which I'm just gonna I'm gonna bomb as many of them as I can. And I really don't particularly care about my poison bar, especially with uh, ten. Oh, forgot about this guy. Hey, oh. You died, you died. Particularly with 10 Estus Flask, it's not a big deal. I mean, it's been ticking away for a while. Look how, what a small part of my life it's taken off. It's another one. He's dead, thank you. All right, let's grab this. Large Titanite Shard, excellent. Let's see, come on, target one of these guys. There's one. Alright. Let's use this one. This one will take two shots. Per oh, nope. Just one! Oh, look at that. Alright, anything, nothing back there. Three more, looks like. And they don't see me. Target him. Beam. Oh, you missed. Oh, crap. Nah. -huh. Ah, yeah, that'll show you. Oh, and he still spat on me. The jerk. My health finally is starting to get low. There's the server. That's a curved, large sword. Also, something else I'm never going to use. But hey, why not pick up every last dumb thing? Um, so everything, I think, is dead on this side, and we've picked up everything. Did we get the, uh, pyromancy stuff? Tattered? Yeah. 
I think we did. I'm pretty sure we did. Yeah, we, we definitely got the pyromancy starting gear. Uh, now we can circle back around. There's a there's an NPC which is gonna whoop hey. Whoop. There's an NPC which is gonna show up, um, which we'll take out on the other side. She's not too bad. There actually none of them are really bad. Hey, oh Solero, to you, to your nothing. There you go. It's over here, nothing. And just roll for it. Transform and roll out! Oh, here's another one. These slugs are freaking everywhere! I think, yeah, I think I was, was I already in this corner? I don't remember, it doesn't matter. Uh, I'm just gonna continue all the way around. Haven't been invaded yet, which is odd. It's pretty common to get invaded in this area. I must say. Um, of all the places I've... This is one of the more PvP-prone spots. I think... Is, are the troll guys? The rock throwers over here? I've already been here because there's nothing on that body. I think the troll... Th are the troll throwers around here or not? I don't know. You did. Oh! Hey-oh! You did. Alright, take another one of these. Let's continue our circuit. There's an item over there we need to get. Um, I could have sworn there was a troll thrower around here. Oh, buddy. Oh, yeah, that's right. These guys take two. Here's the NPC. Here she is. And we can backstab her right off the go. And we can start as soon as she gets up. Do that. Oh! Um, yeah, the, the NPCs are pretty... Predictable in their attack patterns. Oh. Um, really, I'm gonna focus more on the bugs while they're here. The bugs are actually more dangerous. They can, yeah, see how they mess. Up? <laughs> they can mess up anything. Hoop, go, oh. backstab. Oh, are you dead? I think you're dead, lady. Dark Spirit Maneater Mildred Vanquished. What a, oh shit. A stupid bug, leave me alone. Put your knife in humanity. Um, Alright, we still have to get this over here. Yeah, you can actually summon her against the spider boss, but I find her to be pretty goddamn useless. As, as far as summons go. She doesn't really do any damage. The only thing she's really good at is keeping the spider's attention. Uh, so that you can... I think the troll guys are around here. These guys may be tough with my low DPS. Here they are. We can try fireballs, maybe? I don't know. Ow! Oh, okay, you didn't hit me. Whatever. Whoa! Oh, am I out? Oh, no. Man, this D-pad on this controller is terrible. 141! 141! We're about to be out of spells, which is fine. Okay, lovely. I'm, I love how uh, responsive these sorceries are. You know, it just occurred to me... Well, it didn't just occur to me, but it's... Uh, there is a lot more variety to pyromancy spells in terms of how the spells act and operate than there are to sorcery spells. At least at first, you gotta wait till way later to uh, to get the good spells that sorceries. I mean that um, that actually do something other than shoot a really slow missile at things. Yep. Uh huh. Here, yeah, have one of these in your back, jerk face. And I'm not gonna lunge attack these guys. I'm both mostly just gonna sit behind him and backstab him. Kind of like what we did with the guys with the uh, the heavy clubs. Uh, this is the safest way to fight them, If you, at least if you only have to deal with one. The only thing you have to really look out for is they've got an attack where they sort of swing the rock around in a circle. You gotta look out for that. Oh! Hit that, this, that right there. That is the only thing of theirs that really... Um, and even that, it's, not, it's no big deal. It's no big deal, it's no thing. Brick club. Uh, oh! Uh, one more thing that I will never use, the Great Club. 
But uh, I like to pick everything up. Who knows, I may take this character to like level 300 and be able to use everything. I doubt it, but... Um, we're gonna run through the swamp here. There's some trolls over there. We're basically done with our pickup phase. We're gonna go kill the boss soon, but there's a uh, very important merchant right here. And as a side note, when you talk to this merchant mm. like this, and I think pretty much any merchant, undead. Yet you if can uh, see anything me. is chasing you, trying to That's attack you, idea. they will I am quite leave you alone. Isolate. I am not often revealed to walkers of flesh. You have a gift. Are you too one who seeks my pyromancy, like Salomon? I am. I am. Yes, of course. It should be expected. Yep. Very well. You shall be my pupil. Sweet. But to pursue my pyromancy, you must give something up. Uh-oh. Are you prepared to do this? Uh. Oh, okay. Um, yes. I'm ready. So she can upgrade this guy, which I guess I haven't done, have I, at all. But first, let's look at what she sells. Finally, more spells. Or more pyromancies, whatever. Uh, combustion is a good all-purpose spell. Great combustion. Let's grab that one. Already have fireball. And we're out of money. Uh, but we will come back for firestorm and fire whip. What does undead report do? Charm undead and gain temporary allies. Oh, mind control, I guess. Let's, uh... Quick before I die of poison, actually. Let's level this up so my fireballs are doing more damage. And I'll just burn all my souls into this. There we go. Now go. Whatever you lest my time spent on you be wasted. Alright. So there we go. Um here's another item, Titan Shard. So we're done with this phase. Now we need to run back to the bonfire, get all our stuff back, and then head for the Chaos Witch. Up here, there's a big wheel there, there's an area up there with uh, a bunch of stuff. We're gonna take that route to get out of here. I've found that that's the, uh, did I get the item over here? Let me just check. That is the most straightforward way to get out. I did. It would be on that body. Um, so we're gonna go fight the Chaos Witch once we hit up this bonfire, and I guess we can go and repair our gear. My crappy gear, my... Fireball should be doing more damage now. Um, okay, yeah, that's all we need to do. It's already been kindled. Let's go. And I don't think I'm going to bother even killing anything on the way there. Good thing about this ring I'm wearing, I can basically just... I can mostly just roll through the level and look how fast that... Look how fast that recovers. It's very handy. Ah, there Talk you to are. her and watch these guys. I was See him turn around? Anyway. Hmm? Um, don't want to fight rush? that guy. We're going to go around the side here. I don't care about these uh, the mind flare bug things. I just don't really want to worry about giant rocks being thrown at me. So we're going to run up here. Oop. Yep. And grab a purple moss clump. Yeah! And this is actually, up here, is going to be the first covenant we're going to join. The Chaos Witch Covenant, which is going to get us some crazy pyromancies. I may end up specializing more in sorceries. Because it seems like everybody and their brother uses pyromancies, which, I mean, there's a reason for that, because they're good. But, uh, I think I want to... <clears throat> have like weird a weird character so anyway here we go um, chaos witch I guess we'll start with great soul arrow and see how much that damage that does here we go come on Here we go. So, um, hip, hip, run. So, uh, she's not too tough if you just, uh, 
don't let her get too close for you to you but also don't get too far away because she'll do like a leaping attack she's gonna rush we're gonna run she's gonna mind attack or shoot lava one or the other we're gonna yeah that's we want to watch out for that mind attack Whoop. Hey -oh. and just keep our distance this is one of the reasons I wanted that ring so that I'm always able to get away. I'm not never have to worry about. Uh... Oh god, run! Never have to worry about my endurance really with against her. Whoop! Yep, took some damage there. It's fine. Um, the only thing I think that is gonna. Oh! Yep. <laughs> god. Oh god. Here we go. Yeah, shibush, Ah! <laughs> Yeesh, and I'm not I'm not doing a ton of damage against her. I'm not exactly sure how a fireball would do. But we're almost out of these and I guess uh, these ones would have taken off a third of her life. Boop. And um every time you invite someone into your game to uh, help you out, even if you summon an NPC. Oh god. Run! Heal! Um, it increases the hit points of the boss. So, I don't really want to do that. Oh, uh, here's where it's gonna get dangerous. Oh shit, I shouldn't have untargeted her. That was dumb. I was worried about getting hit. I was trying to run away too soon. Don't break your targets until you've shot your homing soul thingy. So let's see. She's down to about a third of her health, and we've got seven of these left. We may be able to finish her just with this. Oh shit, I did it again. That's alright. I'm more concerned with not getting killed. Whoa! Yep. Oh god, gonna get hit. Bro! Probably shippity! Fire! Fire! Run! Ho! Hip! Hip! <laughs> uh, I have no explanation for the sound effects I make when I'm playing. It's just kind of what happens. It's uh, not planned. Oh god! I'm j it's just my primal lower f reptile brain is uh, grunting and groaning as it tries to not get killed. So this is, I think this is the first time I've tried to kill her purely with sorceries, and it's... Oh god! Super effective, except for right there! Oh god, fire! Damn it! No oh shit. Crap, she's gonna jump! All right, she's almost dead. I, hopefully I won't hit lava again this time. Uh, there is a lot of lava on the ground right now. I I did the, uh, the heavy soul arrows first this time, so I've just got the fast ones left. Try and not get hit by that stuff. Oh my gosh, she is almost dead. I, sh I think I'll be able to finish her with the, uh, the soul arrows I have. So this will be 100% Yes! 100% sorcery kill! Oh, that's tense! Um, that would be, that's way better than doing it with my weak-ass Estoc, though. There, she did! And I did it solo, yay! Um, so there you go, she's dead. Now we can actually run back here and join that covenant. Got 20,000 souls, which I think I may hang on to to buy that bellowing dragon crest ring. We can ring the second bell of awakening and open Sen's fortress, which is just a palace full of fun. Here we go.
And there we go. And incidentally, uh, because I have killed the boss in this area, I can no longer be invaded, so I'm not going to reverse hollow until I get to a new area with a new boss, and I uh, will be able to hollow again. This is a shortcut to open up later in Lost Isolith. There's a hidden bonfire back here. I'm going to read what he says this time. Oh dear, what have we here? Are you a new servant? Yes. Mm. But you have no eggs. Ha, no matter. Go along and have audience with our fair lady. Yep. I pray that you will mind your manners. Okay, get out of the way. So, uh, here is the Chaos uh, Covenant, whatever it's called. Here is another Chaos Witch. This chick is um, not going to try and eat us like the last one we just talked to. That NPC merchant that sold pyromancies outside, she's also a Chaos Witch. She managed to escape, I think, was it Isolith before being cursed? I don't remember. Uh, oh, I don't have one of those. Okay, whatever. Let's talk to her. Question mark. There is a way to talk to her where she says stuff. Enter the Covenant. Join Covenant. Yes. And we will get our first Chaos Pyromancy spell. Great Chaos Fireball, a f more powerful version of Fireball. Okay, and you can offer humanity. Watch the top corner, top left corner, the number there is gonna go to zero. I just gave her one. Uh, you have to give her 30 to get to level two of the Covenant and get the other spell. There's only two that I can th that I know of. So that's all, we wanted that. We wanna light this. Oh no, we don't, it's already lit. Um, we don't want... We're going to Homeward Bone. That's a shortcut, leader. Um, I think that's all we need to worry about. So now we can Homeward Bone and run our way out of here. Um, here's Demon Ruins. I don't think there's anything here we really want. There is a bonfire down here we can light. We might as well do that. Because uh, we will want to warp to it later. Or was it the bonfire we was just at that... Uh, no, no, it's right here. Yeah, light it, but not don't rest on it. That's what I want to do. And just look over the edge. We could go fight that thing way over there, ceaseless discharge, but there's no real point. I mean, there is a uh, there's a really awesome suit of poison resist gear over there, but we just finished the major poison area of the game, so it's not as important anymore. We're gonna take off this ninja garb once we get out of here. So, uh, let's Homeward Bone and get our spells back and get the hell out of this place. There we go. Homeward Bone. Yes. There we go. We can rest. And I have 20,000 souls. Um, so, I'm going to save those and try to get those all the way back to... Uh, Firelink Shrine, so that I can buy that ring from the Sorcerer guy. Alright, so let's make a run for it. Let's uh, hope I don't get killed in this next section, which I do quite often. And again, I'm not hol or I'm hollowed right now. I'm not alive. Uh, because I've killed the boss in this area, I can't be invaded. So there's no point to wasting the humanity when I need to save it anyway. Oh, hey -o. Go up there. I need to save it to give to the Chaos Witch to get the next Pyromancy. And once we get both Pyromancies, there's no reason to stay in that Covenant. And at that point, uh, I'll join a different Covenant. Either... Probably the uh, Dark Wraiths. But I haven't decided. Okay, so once we get up to the top of... Here, we're gonna roll off. Transform and roll for it! And this part can be a little confusing. Um, so there's there's actually two areas we need to hit up. Dude. Two areas we need to hit up. Hip. And if you uh, if you hit this guy, it'll stop his psionic attack, by the way. So I can just sit here and poke at him until he dies. Hey oh! Hey oh! Slicey! Um, so there's two areas we need to hit up. 
Uh, one is on the far side, one is sort of in the middle. And let me think about it. Um, I think we need to... Yeah, we need to go up here. Uh, this place can be... I can't... I sometimes forget how all the different ladders connect up and stuff. Um, there's... See that? Yeah, let's take care of these guys now. Thankfully, these guys don't have much hit points. Let's roll backwards. There are toxic shooter guys all over that place. Alright, get off my screen message. <laughs> this weapon. I'm a, I think I'm a, um, off camera. I may farm a Baldur's side sword or something. And level that up because I'm getting sick of this weapon not being able to hit anything. Alright. There's an item right over there which we'll get after we kill these guys. Alright, he's dead. Ooh. See, my shield blocks it. That's why I'm using this shield. Pretty much the only reason. Get off my screen. There. I'm trying to get that message off my screen. There's an item right there that I will get. Once we take care of these guys, these guys are such pains in the asses. Yep. And I want to backstab or push him off or something. Because I don't want that other guy getting me. And he's still alive. Great. Alright, buddy. Smackers. Got you. Alright, off my screen. Alright, where did that other one go? He's, I want to target... No! Oh, God. That was terrible. <laughs> Worst case scenario. Now I'm toxic. Ugh! <laughs> Can't believe I fell off that. Alright, here we go. Thankfully, these guys do not respawn. So once I kill them, they're dead. And I think that was the last one, actually. So my uh, my souls are still down there, and I very much want to get them back. But while I can, I want to bomb these dogs for, from up here. There's nothing else in here except the dogs. Oh god, nope. Here, break that. Thank you. There's nothing else in here except the dogs and those spitters. And uh, I don't exactly remember what I was doing that caused me to fall off of there. Look at that one shot with my great soul arrow. Yeah. Oh! Oh, there's one left. Shit. Forgot. But, uh, shouldn't be a problem. Smack! Yeah, you got me, but I got you last. I got you more. Um, so let's target, come on, target those guys. I don't want to fall down there with these dogs. I could take them on, and I'd probably win, but why risk it when I've got blue lasers of death coming out of my, ow, staff. Here, I'll even give one to you. Win out, and I'll miss, of course. Aha! All right, you get a blue laser of death. You get a blue laser of death. Everybody gets a blue laser of death. And got my souls back. That's what was really important. And I think all the dogs are dead. Um, I think. Oh, no, no, no. There's more down here. Forgot. These are some stupid dogs, man. They don't have very good ears. They can't hear the uh, the laser bolt coming at them. Firekeeper soul. That's what we wanted. We can upgrade the Estus flask with that. Eventually. And there is nothing down here except for that wheel... All right, so now we need to backtrack a little bit. There's a ladder. Where's the ladder? Is it over here? Or no, it's... The ladder's back there. It is. Okay. So, um, when we were coming up here, I said there were two areas we wanted to investigate. This is one of them, and one of the most common ways for me to die in this area is trying to get to this next part when uh, I try to go across this really narrow bridge and fall off. It's always the little tiny platforms that kill me. This thing right here on the left here that's kind of dark, that. We're not going to take that. There's actually... There's a way to go above it, I'm pretty sure. Um, if we go up another ladder, we should be able to cross above it. If I can remember where that ladder is. Where's that ladder? Or is this the top? This is, is this what I'm thinking of? This may... Oh, no, there it is. Yeah, okay. 
So if we go up this, we should be able to cross over, and I think the only thing we really have left are uh, some some of the the, uh, the mind flayer cockroaches and the the mosquitoes. Both annoying, but not really too troublesome. Oh yeah, you tried to psionic blast me, didn't you? Hey ah, hey ah. Yeah, I like that number. That little ditty brought to you by, um, let's see, to get over there, do we have to go up one more? I was pretty certain that you could make it across there. Can you not? Or did I go up too high? Maybe I went up too high. Hi. Hi, bug. How you doing? I think I may have, maybe I went up too high. This place is rather confusing. Let's go down a level, see what happens. I don't recall having an option here to go across, though. No, you gotta go up here. Maybe I can fall off or something. I don't know, I'm getting a little confused, but it doesn't matter. We can get across one way or the other. I was pretty sure you could get across here somewhere. Maybe I'm thinking of this right down here. That looks very like a bad idea to fall down to, though. Is there a ladder here I can climb down? The ladders usually have torches under them. Well, oh, that's no glory. Oh, okay, that works, whatever. Hey, bug, hey, check this one out. Oh, no, fuck. Oh, I'm still alive. That's not what I meant to do. Oh, look at him. He fell off and died. There's that bridge. We'll just take that bridge. Because I know that works. <laughs> I can't believe I'm still alive. That's amazing. Wow. <laughs> um, I thought you could get across there. I must be thinking of something else, man. Because I am just failing up and down. But I do want to go... We're going to get a, a new catalyst, which is what I want. It may not be the catalyst... That I actually, it may not be an upgrade, it may be the one that scales with faith, which is not what I really want. But I'm gonna grab it anyway, who cares? Um, and I think we need to go down a ladder to get across to there, which is fine. I'm, I'm done falling off things for the time being. I've had enough of that crap. Hi. What I was trying to do is this. Pow! Two stabbies. Two stabbies. Oh, and totally miss. Okay, stop messing around. Stab him in his face. Stab him in his face. Repeat until dead. It's like a Dark Souls cookbook. And um, the only other... Yeah, this thing. Look at this. God, I've died on this so many times. I'm just going to go real slow. Every time I try and do this fast... Not every time, but most times. Or some of the time, I end up dead... Dead, dead. Hi. Duh. I like that attack where you uh, go backwards and then attack twice forwards. Hi. Hey. Oh, smack. Yeah, got gotcha. you. All right, I've got some spells left. Let's just burn them. Is there anything left to kill, though? Uh, maybe not. All right, this is what I wanted. The crimson gear and the tin banishment catalyst. I don't even know if... Well, I'll check in a second. We'll, we'll look. And a sorcery, which cures poison. Yeah, convenient to get that now. All right, tin ca tin banishment catalyst. Scales with oh magic, good. And let's see, I can use all of it. Look at the magic adjust. It's lower actually than what I'm using for some reason. I'm not sure why. I thought it would be better, but uh, I guess it's not. And it's a little heavier as well. It may scale better in the long run. We'll see. Uh, but I have it and the sorcerer's gear. Or that uh, that that uh, crimson gear, whatever that's called. Um, that's what I wanted. That's good magic stuff. It looks very magic-y. And oh, oh god, you see that? You see what's going on here? Ah! <laughs> Sometimes the pathfinding, especially in these little areas with these little 
the uh, something about the geometry of the way this place is built, the way the game works, sometimes you can just get stuck. And it's like a guaranteed death almost. It's freaking annoying. But we are done with Blight Town. We're done with the depths. Um, there's still some challenging areas in the game. Um, but a lot of the frustrating, like, cliffs to fall off part is, is done. At least for the foreseeable future. There's a section in Anne Orlando, and it, certainly Sense Fortress has balance beams, but, um, I don't know. I'm, I'm tired of this place. I don't hate it as much as most people, but it definitely, it wears, it wears you down, man. It wears you down over time. And I escaped with my 24,000 souls. I was thinking of just making a, a mad dash for it from this point and not killing these trolls up here. But I think I'm going to fight them because I've got 12 heavy soul arrows left. Why not burn them? Key to New Londo Ruins. That's important. Um, yeah, this is one of the places where you can get knocked off this ledge by these guys. And I'm going to just going to... And you got to fight two of them at once. Unless you pull them really carefully and then... then if you pull them one at a time, you gotta fight them back here on this ledge. Oh, look at me blow him backwards! Take that! Oh, you don't want none! Oh, I just disintegrated you with my laser beam wand. Alright, then there's one more. Or, no, there's two more up here. My bad, I'm, I'm remembering it wrong. Oh, okay. Um, shit. Smack! Actually... Hey, ho! We can shoot this way faster. And we've leveled up our gloves so we can... Uh, they do more damage and we can hit them both at once. And it's doing uh, pretty good damage on them. It seems to, to like, stun them, sort of. All right, now I'm gonna finish you with my sword. Backstab for the win. Dung pie. All right. So that's it, that's Blight Town. Here is the exit that leads to uh, Valley of the Drakes, which will lead us directly to New Londa Ruins, and then we will ride the elevator up to Firelink. Right here, just don't fall off, buddy. Don't fall off! Whoa! Run across. And we should be home free. If I die now, that would be hysterical. <laughs> here we go. Made it back here. No biggie. And then back to the elevator. Oh! Yep. Oh, and the, the man. Oh, I almost... <laughs> I did almost die. I almost fell down that hole. Because I expected the elevator to be here for some reason. Let's see. We can start switching up our gear. I'm going to go over it in more detail off camera. Figure out exactly what I want to use. And here we go. Back to Firelink. And there's going to be a little plot twist here. And some free gear, free gear, plot twist, pre gear. And we're nearly done with this video. Back to Firelink, and let's talk to our firekeeper to upgrade our thingamajobbles. Oh, she's not there. Village corpse, bloodstained skirt, dingy stuff, which is really good. Black eye orb, dead, okay. Black eye orb, what could that be? Let's look. In, whoop, man, this D-pad on this Xbox controller is terrible. Invade world of murderer of Firekeeper. So you can see use item is crossed out. We can't use it here. We have to find the right area to use it. And she's dead. Someone killed her. And who was sitting here that promised us a present that is no longer sitting here? Yep, Knight Lautrec. The guy with the sickles. Hey, buddy. Did you ring the second bell? Uh, I that did. That is incredible, I must say. But now we have a new problem. It's noisy. It snores. 
All right. And its breath is lethal. This is no laughing matter, I tell you. Okay. Anything Damn. else? That stench. And I was really beginning to like it here. Oh, maybe it's time I do something about it. Whoa. You gonna leave? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna oh, do? Maybe it's right. time. He's done talking. Um, so last thing before we end this video, let's talk to our bud well, here. Then, well, you certainly are keeping myself. Purchase an item. Bellowing Dragon Crest Ring boosts sorcery. Yes, please. There we go. Um, let's see. The only other thing he has that we really want is the Great Heavy Soul Arrow, which is exactly like Heavy Soul Arrow, but an upgraded version. Um, I may eventually get Magic Shield, but I don't really like it very much. Unless I All use right. that other ring to in, do it. to prolong that the effect. That should help you on your journey. May we yep. meet again. Yep. Okay. So, um, that's it for this video. We will now swap out Chloranthi Ring with Bellowing Dragon Crest and do more damage. Yay. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We'll continue next time. Um, we're going to have to find another bonfire for one thing, because we can't use it, because the Firekeeper is absent. Um, this and many other things next time on Dark Souls Prepare to Die Edition. Big Boar Helm. Flippity flabbity flu. Alright, see you later, guys. Bye bye.